Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing the no mirror makeup challenge. So I don't have a single mirror in front of me. My standing mirror is under my desk. My viewfinder is flipped around so I can't see my own reflection. So let's jump straight in. First, I'm going to be taking the Chi Chi Brow Pomade in the shade Dark Brown. I hope this turns out semi okay because I do have to go out later. Probably gonna end up with like gigantic slugs. I'm honestly not gonna do any more than that. I'd rather just have thinner eyebrows. So I'm then just gonna set those down with the L'Oreal Brow Artist Plumper. This is in the shade medium dark. Normally I can, would conceal under my brow to clean it up, but I don't think I'm going to be able to do that today. I'm going to go in with the Astralis Original Primer. I'll link my previous video down below. I did a full face of Astralis. So check that one out if you haven't already. This part is obviously so easy. Astralis Stay Put foundation. I'm just going to pop a bit on the back of my hand. Above here is going to be pretty hard. Make sure I don't cover up that, those eyebrows. Now that the foundation is on, we will move on to concealer. So I'm going to use the Maybelline Master Conceal. This is in the shade Fair Claire. I'm going to pop some on my finger. And then, without poking myself in the eye, blend it underneath. I'm just going to set that side down before I conceal the other side in the shade 135 Creamy Natural. As you can see, I keep pan. So I'm just going to set under there and set my eyelids down. Okay, and then I'm going to go in and set the face and go in with my Astralis. Fresh and flawless powder in the shade Deep Natural. I'm just going to go in and set the rest of that foundation down. And I'm going to go in with the powder contour from Astralis in the shade Taupe. This stuff is so good, another thing that I really loved from my last video. Oh, it's going to be difficult. I feel like I'm under that. And blend it. Then I'm going to bronze up my face. I'm going to go with the Chi Chi Face Bronzer in the shade Bronze Me Up. Slap it on. So going in again with another Astralis product. This is the powder blush in the shade of Blaze. Of course, it's going to be hard to not make myself look like a clown. So just on the apples and brush it back. I 
I'm going to use my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in the shade L Big fan brush. I feel, I feel like I could be able to do this bit. You can't really mess this bit up. Feeling like your cheekbone is. And blending. I take whatever left down my nose. And just lightly buff that on the skin. I've got three little NYX shadows here. Got them in the shade LOL, Heat, and Bad Seed. So I'm going to use those and I'm also going to dip into the Australis Neutralize palette as well. So I'm thinking I might start with the shade Praline, which is that one just there. So I'm just going to find the crease of my eye, look down and you'll feel it. I'm going to tap off so much excess of this so it doesn't look too crazy. Pop that in the crease and I'm just going to very, very lightly blend that in. I'm going to go in and do the other one. Again, just finding your socket, your crease, sorry, and looking down. Okay. We've made it through that, that's fine. So I'm going to go in with the shade LOL from NYX, that orangey shade, on the same brush. Tap off the excess. And again, try and get it in that crease. And blending back and forth. I'm just going to take a fluffier brush with nothing on it and I'm just going to blend above that crease and make sure those colours are blended out nicely. changing outside. I'm going to pop the Bad Seed shade through my crease as well. And that's got the little gold flecks in it, but hopefully it's topping off so much excess. I just want to pop that through my crease. Now, let's move on to the lid. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the shade Mocha. Hopefully you guys can still see that. I'm going to use my finger, because I think that's going to be the easiest way to apply this, I hope. Okay, so now we've popped that shade on the lid, I'm going to blend Nothing on my brush. I'm just going to blend the crease. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. I really want to add something deeper or like black, but let's just move on before it gets worse. Okay, so we'll do the lower lash line. And I'm going to take that LOL shade, so that orangey shade. This part I'm worried about, not having a mirror. I'm not poking myself in the eye. So I'm just going to run that from inner corner to outer corner. And then I'm just going to take the Bad Seed shade, which is, which is that red shade. I don't want to put too much of this on because I don't want to look like I've got pink eye. But just running that over that orange. Okay. I'm just going to darken that up. I'm going to take the shade Fudge, which is that one there. I 
Okay, moving on to mascara. I'm going to take the Essence I Love Extreme Volume Mascara. Okay, I'm going to attempt the bottoms. Quite scared about this one. Okay, so all that's left is lips and setting spray and we're done. So I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Color Sensational lipstick in the shade 725 Tantalizing Taupe. Putting lipstick on without a mirror is it's pretty easy, pretty straightforward. And then on top of that, I'm just going to take the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Praline. It's just a bit deeper. Oh God. So darken that up a bit. Final step guys, setting spray. Back in with my Urban Decay All Nighter. Okay guys, so we are now going to have a look. So I just grab my mirror from under my desk. And moment of truth. Wow. I am honestly very, very surprised at this. Very, very surprised. The brows are pretty good. I'm not 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 too mad. This one's looking a little bit a little bit sad underneath. But yeah, all in all, I am pretty, pretty stoked. That highlighter is, is blinding. I'll just zoom you in a little bit so you can see. I've got a little bit of fallout from the Astralis shadow that we put on the lid, but all of them do that, so that's okay. How amazing. And I have a little bit, a little bit of mascara transfer just here. Okay guys, so that is the end of this video the no mirror makeup challenge thank you guys so much for watching please hit that subscribe button down below and click on the notification bell to be notified when i upload uh, thank you guys so much for being here and i'll see you on my next one